a woman that has walked the talk and commanded her space in a field mainly dominated by men. Gertrude Akapelwa is Zambia's first computer scientist and her prolific and profound achievements and contributions to technology advancements in Zambia has caught the attention of the highest office. You were the first female computer expert at the African Development Bank. In 2009, you became the first board chairperson for Zambia Information and Communication Technology Authority, ZICTA. Dr. Akapelwa is among Zambia's honored during the investor ceremony as Zambia celebrated 60 years of independence. She now shares her journey. And I was the only girl out of the five, in the middle of the guys. So I grew up comparing myself to the guys. So even when I was going to school, I, w I had the freedom to choose what I wanted. I was not following the boys because they had their own capacities and I had my capacity. So that's why I chose ICT. And Among then, her notable achievements now, and contributions made to society in her individual world. capacity is the establishment of a university. And then I started supporting the ADB using ICT in development with the, what is this company that is, the international company that is in, in Geneva. They are the ones who, who regulate all ICT in the whole world under UN. So I would go there and would negotiate and talk to different countries and present the best practices in telecommunication and connectivity and so on and so forth. Dr. Akapelwa has a message for the female folk in Zambia. The complex of being women shouldn't be there anymore. If you have it, if you know what you are looking for, go for it and do it. If you don't know, look for somebody who knows. They will, they will advise you, or they will help you, or they will sponsor you. But if you don't express it to anybody, then you don't find the helpers. With her historical achievements, Dr. Akapelwa stands as a tower of inspiration for many Zambians, especially the girl child, who seeks to make a change and contribute to the country's development. Rosemary Kamanga, ZNBC News in Lusaka.